I have a weird dad. I think he uh, he knows nothing about technology. I was on the computer one time, and he walks in. He's like, hey, Mac, you ever hear about this thing called instant messaging? <laughs> <laughs> it's like an email, but it's live, like a text. I'm like, yeah, dad, I know what that is. Why are you crouching? <laughs> like, your mother thinks I'm downstairs. And then he scurried away. <laughs> And I was on the computer, a couple days later, I get a message, and the message says, Bone Snake 2, I sent you a message. Do you accept? And I'm like, yeah, this, this is going to be hilarious. So I click it, and the message is, hey, it's your dad. <laughs> what? <laughs> Bone Snake 2? <laughs> that, that is the creepiest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> and is Bone Snake 1 already taken? Like, what... <laughs> Is Grandpa Bone Snake one? <laughs> Do I have to be Bone Snake three now? <laughs> you would also flip out. He has mood swings a lot. I think he's bipolar. I don't know. I'm not a doctor. My next guess is menopause. I don't know. <laughs> I just go back to happy, flip out back to happy in seconds. I was in their basement watching TV one time, and he comes down, and he goes, looking good, buddy. Just gotta grab some out of the storage room here. And as he walks in, he trips over a box my mom put in his way. That's what he said, I think she just set it down. But apparently it was in his damn way. Because now I can't even hear the TV. He's screaming at the top of his lungs, kicking and throwing boxes, ruining our Christmas ornaments. And as he walks out, he looks up the stairs and goes, Darn it, Jackie, you screwed me again! <laughs> Slams the door, sees me, and he's like... <laughs> so you got any shows this week? And I'm like, yeah, you psycho, what was that about? <laughs> Nothing, just normal stuff? Nope, no it wasn't, Dad. <laughs> Going crazy over a bunch of boxes in the basement isn't normal stuff, it's actually the plot to The Shining. <laughs> I got so bad when I was a kid, we went to a family therapist. And was, this is what the guy told us to do. He said, whenever your dad flips out like that, everyone else in the family should go in the other room and get these matching yellow hats. And we'll put them on, not say anything, and just stare at my dad until he calms down. That's what a doctor told us to do. Every time I think about that, I think it was just some Stanford prison level experiment. Where a psychologist is sitting in his office one day, like thinking really hard, like, I wonder if I can get a guy to kill his whole family. <laughs> Try this yellow hats thing out on the Cronins. <laughs>